Wood-fired pizzas are nothing new in Chicago, but you don't see a lot of all-natural starters using wild yeast. At Roebuck Pizza in Lakeview, they've been working on their recipe for months, launching pies into their mammoth brick-red pavese oven until they emerge with blistered edges. We bring to pizza making a philosophy that brewers bring to beer, which is that yeast can have a really big impact on the flavor of the finished meal. Uh, so we wanted to do that with pizza. It's soppressata instead of pepperoni here, added to handfuls of fresh mozzarella. The pies bake directly on the stone hearth, a few inches from the fire. Post-bake, the soppressata gets some pickled jalapenos and a drizzle of hot honey. Purists might opt for the sausage, pinched and pressed Chicago style, of course, with red onions. And they're not necessarily going for traditional Neapolitan heat levels, which require faster baking and thus wet middles. These beauties are baked a bit lower and a bit longer. Leopard spotting without the soupiness. You get a lot of that softness that you'd expect, but then you get a little bit of crispiness on the bottom that we think people really like. Over in Avondale, Ludlow Liquors recently started doing a pizza night every Monday. Here, it's strictly Sicilian style. The oven that we have uh, necessitates doing um, a Sicilian style. Um, just it's lower heat, longer bake, uh, higher, uh, bigger rise in the dough. I want that bottom layer to be crispy, crunchy, fried. He offers four flavors every Monday. Cheese, pepperoni, a vegan, plus a wild card where he gets really creative. The highlight is that undercarriage, which has a much crispier texture than any Sicilian in town. It's ultimately baked three times. It's baked, par baked once, then topped, baked again, comes out, cut, baked a third time before the guest eats it. So it is pizza night every Monday here at Love the Liquors, and those four flavors always on hand. The wild card flavor will always change each week, but I would highly recommend either getting the pepperoni or the cheese because they're both fantastic, especially that bottom crust. In Avondale, Steve Delinsky, ABC7 Eyewitness News. Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.